Today we are going to unbox the TP-Link TL-WA830RE wireless extender. This works up to 300 megabits with wireless N and is a range extender for your wireless connection. Let's see the specifications on the right of the box. So the standard uses IEEE 802.11b, 11g, 11n. The interface uses uh, RJ45 port. The frequency between 2.4 and 2.48 gigahertz up to 300 megabits per second. Uses two antennas with a RPSMA connector. The security uses a WEP, WPA and WPA2 PSK encryption. It does MAC address filtering and SSID control. So let's start by opening the product. Let's take the things off, and there it is. One of the things I like about uh, TP-Link uh, TP, uh, TP products is that uh, they use recyclable paper and not plastic to all the, the devices. So that's a point for them. I like that. So what's it? What is uh, in the box? We have the device, the range extender. We have a quick installation guide, a CD, a very small CD. I don't, I don't know what the software is. Okay, we will see it later. Some other instructions and in, in various languages a GNU general public license notice okay a small RJ45 cable very small about 1 to 1.5 meters two antennas using the RP SMA connector. We'll see it later. Or and last, our uh, transformer for power. It is a TP-Link transformer. The model is T09006060-1. The input is 102 to four, uh, 240 volts at 50 hertz and 0 0.3 amperes. The output is 9 volts. Okay, it's very light. And that's everything in the box. Let's take it out of the way. And this is everything that comes inside the box. So you can see so this is everything. Let's check our range extender. It, it's uh, all plastic. It got some ventilation on the top and, of, and on the bottom. It got uh, five LEDs and on the back we have uh, the connectors for the two antennas that uses RP SMA connector so you, you screw the, the antenna you got the on and off button power connector the ethernet connector using an uh, RJ45 a button for the range extender and another button for the reset. So you can use this in two ways. 
you got your router and you connect uh, the Ethernet cable to the extender and to the router and you put the antennas you screw both of the antennas and you now can have a, a much better range of wireless connection but if you don't want to use the the cable you have a button for the range extender you press a button on your router and the button on the range extender and that, that will create a connection between the devices so your router will send the information for the range extender and the range extender will uh, have more range for the wireless communication but normally what I would I will use this for is to get more wireless um, area in other parts of my house that are far away from the router this is a very small a very short cable less than two meters I will get a 20 meter cable I'll connect the 20 meter cable to the range extender and to the router and then I will get wireless connection to uh, other parts of my house and that's the objective of this range extender. I will test this and see if it's good, if the if can get up to 300 megabits per second, if the connection is good. But for that test, subscribe to the channel to watch my test. In other tests I will do with this to see if the product is good. An interesting thing is that the temperature is between 32 and 100 uh, degree Fahrenheit. That's a lot. So I'll be testing that if these get hot. So subscribe to the channel to follow my tests with this device. Give a like if you like this unboxing, if this was helpful to you and leave a comment if you have any question about this device or other device like this and I will answer you on the on the comment section and that's everything that comes in this unboxing I hope you like it and I will see you on other video thank you